Hi guys and welcome to another track guide video. This is my second track guide video of the week and as you can see here I ended up in top 10 position uh, exactly in 8th position so I will do a track guide for Tokyo Expressway South Outer Loop so let's get started. So first you may want to do an outlap just to get your top speed onto the main straight and as we come into our first breaking point and here I'm using the 50 meter mark as a reference you may want to break just a little bit before that but 50 meters should work and now into this right hander so staying as close as possible to the wall on the right getting to a left side of the track into 4 gear and getting from left to the right piece of the track using the whole width of the track here and I, I sh watch, just watch my just watch my throttle inputs here just a little lift through those uh, through those corners nothing too much on the power nice and easy as fast as you can that that's really crucial through here here you can see me lifting just a little bit here and back on the power so it's really crucial to stay stay on the power maybe i could have gained here a couple of tenths but a couple of thousands of seconds sorry but my best time overall so let's let's get into our next breaking point here I'm using the 100 meter mark as a reference, but you want to break somewhere around 110, 120. That that should work for you. Getting that apex nice and easy in the first gear. As you can see me turning the wheel upside down. I'm using I'm using the whole wheel rotation and nice and easy on the power back again in the second gear. And now we're gonna fast forward this straight because there is pretty much nothing going on here. It's it's straight. You can you cannot change your lap on on this uh, on this trade. So, and getting closer to your next breaking point, as you can see here, I'm using the 50 meter mark as reference for this breaking point. So, just breaking just at 50 meters, uh, breaking just a little bit in the straight line, so you can get the apex nice and clean here. A little bit of trail breaking, nothing too much, and just watch my watch my throttle inputs here, nice and easy, fast on the throttle and getting those lap times perfect. So into our next breaking point here, I'm using the 50 meter mark as reference and also the sign after the 50 meter mark. Here you want to shift downshift into four gear, getting that apex nice and easy into third gear, just hitting those curbs and it's really crucial that you stay on the power. You might feel you don't have the traction or the grip to do so, but you want to believe the car and you want to put all the power down and hope for, for the best lap possible. As you can see here, I ended my lap in 122.395, which ended me in top 10. So guys, I really hope this track guide helped you, and it, if it really did, so le please leave a like down below and subscribe to the channel. So thank you for watching, and until the next time, bye.